the game with the, with the run game yesterday. Uh, as tight ends and receivers, do you guys get in that same kind of rhythm as the O line does when you're blocking like that? Yeah, 100%. You know, it feels great when you're firing all cylinders and, you know, our offense, you know, throughout the season is just, um, you know, been based off the run game. You know, when we run the ball good, we're winning football games, and uh, that's what we did yesterday, and it was really good. When you caught that pass, do you know you would get all the way there? Was there any, any doubt at all that you'd get to that pylon? Um, you know, when I, when, I, when I caught that ball and I get close to the end zone like that, I'm just, you know, I smell blood, and I'm just trying to get in the end zone, and I do everything I can, and that was kind of the, the feeling right there. Oh, I had a big catch, too. What did you just think about kind of the tight end play in general? I know it was a running game day, but you guys had some good yeah. moments. Um, Noah's catch was huge, you know, with our ability and you know, athleticism to stretch the field for him to, uh, you know, make that play down the field. Um, you know, just, just was it just to show, you know, how we create mismatches. You know, that was a really big play, um, you know, get us in the red zone and um, capitalize off of it. What's it like as a young guy experiencing this sort of some juice in this town? Seven and six, you're in the mix. There's two changes. What's it like around the building in the locker room? This is probably what looks like your latest yeah, I mean, it's it's not like, uh, you know, we just take every game the same, you know. It's just um, we know everything we want is in front of us still. You know, we treat every game as a playoff game. And, um, you know, just know, just know what we have to do in order to get what we want. And that's just the kind of the emotion around locker room. Well, obviously, it was a huge uh, kind of improved red zone pressure in the last game. Um, really just running the ball well, to be honest with you. Um, you know, when, when, when teams can't stop us in the run game, you know, that we're, we're unstoppable. And, and uh, you know, that's, that's what we saw yesterday. You're talking about the importance of that run game. How do you feel you've developed as a run blocker over the course of this season? Just being more consistent, being better with technique, and just you know knowing overall the scheme better. You know, just knowing who, who we're all going to, who we're comboing to. Um, I feel like that's probably the biggest difference. Coach Harmon, how does his kind of guidance, leadership, how has it influenced the room this year? It's been huge. You know, he's got a lot of he's got a lot of experience. He's coached a ton of guys, and you know, just his ability to you know shed his wisdom on us has been really big. You know, when you have someone who's been doing it for as long as him, you know, he's learned a lot. He, he has a lot of, uh, of things to teach us. So that's definitely how he's been able to help us. Do you think the team has recently found their identity of running the ball as, as success? I'd say so. You know, I mean, we just got to be consistent with it. You know, you know, we've shown that we're capable of running the ball really well. Um, you know, we have the guys to do it, you know, in the backfield and in, in the trenches. So, um, you know, just got to be consistent with it. Just got to execute, you know, week in, week out. Um, so I'd say, you know, we definitely have an identity as an offense. We just got to be consistent with it. You've had impressive, you've had impressive wins over the Chargers and then the Lions. Does it feel like you're getting a home field advantage? Definitely. You know, I feel like that's a, that's a big thing about this organization and team is, you know, we, we do have a real home advantage with, with our atmosphere, with our crowd, with our fans. So, yeah, I'd say definitely. Thank you, Albert. Thank you.